Good day and welcome to everyone joining us for this preview for Fairview Racing on the Turf. The first race is due off at 12.25. They'll do battle over 1,000 metres down the lane. With me in studio is Paul Lafferty. Paul, welcome to the show. Thank you. Right, let's get uh, see if we can we, uh, be as accurate as we were last time. We weren't too bad. The favourites arrived for us. Well, let's get straight into the action. The first race, looking at the betting, number eight, which is Divine Design, is five to ten. They're betting eight to one numbers, five and ten. Red Sphere and Glass Shoes. Race number one looks pretty cut and dried with number eight, Divine Design. Looking at the form pool, second to Rhythm of the Rain, first time out, should go on better. Absolutely good debut, and uh, from a top yard, well bred. I remember Empress of Oz well. The captain's walls are flying. And uh, it was only beaten a half a length. It was a very good run. It was over six furlong. It's now five furlong. And uh, uh, unless you get something like the, the Versa and Gitrix number 10, who's at eight to one, being a, a decent sort, I think uh, Divine Design will be very hard to beat. That's number eight in the opening event. And then number nine, Dreamscape. This is a daughter of Visionaire from the Miller Stable. Ran second first time out, although well beaten, eight and a half lengths, and then just over six lengths behind them last time. Both form lines have been franked. Yeah, and if you look at this last run, Dreamscape, it got left. Both runs, it's funny enough, it's got left, but it got left two lengths, so that means slow into stride. So uh, I would make Dreamscape a, a definite danger. And then we'll throw in number 12, Loving You Baby, on the Rhythm of the Rain run. So throw in number 12, Loving You Baby. But in race number one, Paul and I both agree, number eight, Divine Design, deep in the red, but should come home and win this contest. So race number one, the odds on favourite, very tough to beat.